welcome to my cooking show. So this is going to be posted on the one and only Valentine's Day and I was like what should I do for Valentine's Day this year? I feel like I need to do a YouTube video, I feel like I need to do something. And then on my TikTok for you page it came up with a heart shaped chocolate pizza and I just thought I want to try and make that. So welcome to my cooking show. This honestly could go really, really, really badly and it honestly could taste like actual. Okay, so I was scrolling through the old Pinterest, obviously, and came up with some kind of inspiration for what I want the pizza to look like because, you know, it's going to be like pizza-based chocolate with like fruit and stuff on top. Like I thought like strawberries with a bit of banana. I might like write something with some like icing, like a fun quote. I'm actually really excited. And when I say I'm baking a pizza, um, I did buy pizza bases because I'm not making it from scratch. I can't, I literally can't. I'd rather not make a gluten free pizza base. I'm sorry, shoot me. I've adjusted the angle so you can see what I'm doing and I've got a nice workspace. But I was thinking, I feel like I need to bake the base for a little bit. I don't know if anyone else agrees with me, but I low-key think cold pizza is better than warm pizza. But like, pizza that you cook, that you put in the fridge, and then it's like next day. I would argue it's better. So I've got this, but I don't want it to be this shape, because this isn't very Valentine's Day. I want to cut it. And I want to make it a heart. Yeah, I need to do a heart shape, but I feel like it might be a bit tricky. Do I do it with scissors? I'm not really sure what I'm gonna do with the off cuts either. Maybe I'll make little pizza bites to go with it. I feel like I should bake this first. Um, but while I'm cooking, I'm gonna share with you some insight into why you shouldn't it should matter if you are not doing anything this Valentine's Day because quite frankly I honestly don't think it matters I have never th thought it matters even when I was in a relationship I'm pretty sure we didn't do anything because Valentine's Day let's be honest is a way for businesses to make money but yeah I think I even when I was in a relationship on Valentine's Day I'm pretty sure I think I baked him a cookie, but that was all I did. To be honest, it's really not all that, even if you are in a relationship. So maybe just do something with your friend or something. So me and my friend are going to brunch tomorrow. Take yourself on a nice brunch day with your girl. You don't actually have to go on a date on Valentine's Day. Like, I feel like people always kind of like, hype valentine's day up and then if it's not really good then they're disappointed whereas if you don't hype it up like it's yeah you can never be disappointed okay so i'm gonna chuck this in the oven for like five minutes just to kind of bake it a little bit it's also kind of um the top layer's coming up but we're just not gonna we're not that's not my oven, that's my grill. So people might hate me for this, but I personally think that my favorite Italian food is actually pasta. Like pizza, I would, like I went to an Italian restaurant, I would order like an Arabiata pasta or a car, like a, a vegan carbonara. I'm not gonna be going and ordering pizza. I don't know, I think the, the thought of pizza is always better than the actual outcome other than if you're drunk slash on a hangover then pizza is absolutely sensational and nothing can beat it so it's time to prepare the toppings for a pizza cake so in here i just have some like vegan chocolate spread i'm gonna get some blueberries we love a blueberry i love a blueberry 
also chocolate covered strawberries. I've just thought about them and I really <laughs> but these strawberries are kind of going off so we do need to utilize them. So this is another reason why this is a perfect recipe. And um, there's nothing worse than a monkey strawberry. And then we've also got banana. I feel like the best way to cut the strawberries is gonna be like this and then we can place them in a nice array for pattern around so that it looks pretty because I want to make this look pretty. I want it to be very Pinterest friendly. I might even post it on my Pinterest. I am plugging my Pinterest right now but I am obsessed with it and I spend so much time on Pinterest nowadays. Um, and I actually post my own pictures on Pinterest, like most of it's like me, if that makes sense. So you should follow my Pinterest. Imagine you take the pizza out so we can Also, I don't know if anyone's ever done this, but have you ever opened a banana and put a chocolate bar in it and then put the banana in the oven for like a minute? It's really good if you like the warm banana and you like the good with chocolate. You should try that. I used to have it as a child all the time and I had it the other day and it was sensational. So I basically prepared. That really did not take very long, did it? So I've adjusted the angle so you can really see what I'm doing. Let's actually clear this up a little bit because I'm a messy cook. If you've watched this far into my Valentine's Day fiasco, um, comment what your favourite fruit is because I go through phases with fruits, but at the moment it's actually banana. So here's my pizza. And just, I feel like this might be a bit much actually. I'll take some chocolate spread and we just put it all over as a base. I don't exactly know who I'm giving this to. Um, maybe I'll give it to my mum and my dad so that I can then eat it because it will still be in the house. I'm really intrigued what this will taste like. It might taste disgusting. Okay, this looks absolutely like trash from this angle. So I'm gonna show you it from this angle instead because it looks less like trash. I was thinking marshmallows would have been really good on this. I don't have any vegan marshmallows. Maybe if you make this, put some marshmallows on it. So we're gonna just, do I do like banana on the outside? Yes. Oh my God, I'm, like, I'm actually a genius. When I do banana around the outside, I'm gonna have to cut up the rest of the banana now. Oh well. I'm gonna do banana around the outside in like, to enhance the heart shape. Oh my, this is actually looking really, really cute. Oh my god. Wait, wait. I think I've actually made something somewhat successful here. I might be onto something. I should sell these. Imagine. I'm selling um, gluten free vegan chocolate covered pizzas for Valentine's Day next year. You watch out. Also, we now have some banana, but you know what? We'll just keep that. I was going to have blueberries on this, but to be honest, like, there isn't really space and I've already cut up the strawberries, so maybe I'll put like <laughs> one blueberry in. But I'm going to just fill the um, middle bit with little half pieces of strawberries. Um, I was going to do them as like bigger chunks, but now I think it looks cuter, cut up a bit smaller. <laughs> I'm kind of proud of myself. But as soon as it becomes near to the 14th of February, they're like so, uh, somehow like 20 quid for like four but like, what that doesn't make any sense to me i've actually completed um the design and i don't mean to be up my own self but look at it have you ever seen such a cute pizza i'll give you a if you're a little preview, like look at it, it's actually really really cute. I'm kind of obsessed with it. So I don't know how long to put 
put it in for? Should I just put it in for like another four or five minutes? Yeah, we'll do that. Then she goes. Oh, my little princess. I actually don't know about you, but I've, I've got, I don't mind the cleaning up aspect of cooking. Mm -hmm. Um, and this is why everybody should want to live with me because I just impulsively clean. But I shall check back with you when the pizza's done. I want to check the pizza because I'm really stressed that I'm going to burn it. So, ah! I'm going to give it one more minute. I'm going to try some. I will present it to my parents. Slash, I don't think my mum is here, so I will present it to my father. To be honest, he'll probably be like, I don't want to eat that because it's gluten free and vegan. But he's one of those people that like, he'll eat something, right? And it will be vegan or it'll be gluten free. And he will be like, oh, this is really nice. And then I'll tell him it's vegan and gluten free and he'll be like, mm, it's not great. Anyway, I'm going to get it out of the other one because I'm, I think it's done. Oh my God, she's so cute. <gasps> I'm so proud of myself. This is what the completed pizza looks like. It's a bit hot right now. But I'm actually kind of kind of proud of her. I'm gonna put it on a um, cooling rack because I don't want it to go soggy. Like I don't want a soggy butter in my very Look how cute she is. Okay, I need to stop moving it around because I'm going to drop it on the floor and then it's going to be a disaster. Personally, I think it's going to be nice. What do you rate it out of 10? Nine. It's quite high. day do something take yourself out for lunch or brunch or message one of your friends and do something for valentine's day because it's you know it's a celebration but don't spend too much money on your relationship because it's just the businesses have an employ to get you to spend 10 pounds on a bunch of roses anyway love you guys Beautiful day. Happy Valentine's Day.